we sent some uh, we sent some pigs to um, a couple of restaurants in Sydney uh, two weeks ago, and and we both got feed unsolicited feedback from both of them saying that they're the best pork they'd ever seen. Amazing. Mm. Well, it's not amazing. It's expected, mm. really. Yeah. <laughs> this is where we're now. Uh, when I worked in the bakery in Sydney in the 70s and 80s, there was only small demand, and I maintain 90% of the people that became customers of the Demeter Bakery in Sydney did so out of necessity. They had health problems. Okay. Yeah, and that was the main driver. There was only 5 or 10% who came because of taste. Yeah? But those who came from health problems uh, developed the taste. Yeah? And, and it grew. So their sort of health question... Uh, turned into a plus in the end for them mm. because they got better food and um, that that activity couldn't really grow very much because there weren't the people growing the produce so there's no point in going to the consumers and saying hey guys here's some great tucker yeah. if there was no one growing it mm. and that's what's exciting now because there's more and more produce being grown by people like Rod and so okay it's only a couple of restaurants a couple of pigs but the word is out there. This mm -hmm. is this is quality stuff, mm. and that will encourage more people to grow pigs in a mm. better way, and will gradually change change the whole culture. Um, and you know, I'm not, I don't focus on being anti um, keeping chooks in cages or whatever. What we've got to do is get out there and make it possible for people to grow pigs or chooks or beef or wine in a in a sustainable and um, ecologically sound way. Mm. And the skills are there. It's just now a matter of growing the skills out. And the skills will always improve um, and be developed. And that's another aspect. The more people that we get going into this biological, organic, sustainable, biodynamic approach, <clears throat> the sooner we're going to get new initiatives, you know, mm. people waking up with new ideas mm. and growing the ideas out and improving um, our outcomes.